Hello YouTube, Blue Batona here, and welcome to episode 10 of this Let's Play Rome Total War as Carthage Campaign. Uh, where we left off last time was a, uh, what did I title the video? A disastrous underestimation, or something along those lines. Um, essentially, I lost Tarentum to the Scipii because uh, I fought a very poor battle where I, I got my general killed. Uh, I'd underestimated the strength of their general's cavalry, and, uh, and yeah. That's pretty much that. Uh, it's, a, it's a settlement I'm going to have to take back. Uh, but we are still in a fairly strong position. Um, we have quite a good garrison here in the city of Rome. Uh, the Julii have been throwing army after army at our walls and have been uh, repelled uh, each, pretty much each and every time. And we have a pretty good uh, number of units. Uh, or pretty sorry, a pretty good number of. Um, <clears throat> infantry now in the settlements uh, should it come to another uh, settlement defense. Second, we do have a large, significant, and st strong relief force moving north that I am gonna was originally planning on bringing into this theater, maybe here, um, but they are rerouted north into uh, the Italian peninsula after the defeat of our army at Tarentum. Um, finally, we need to just keep training troops here, making sure that we're not uh, giving up Proton as well, and uh, continue the training of Sacred Band here in Syracuse. Uh, definitely don't want to stop uh, the training of those units. Um, here in Carthage, we could also begin the construction of a new force, um, and we are going to get that started. We'll get pulled up some cavalry. Uh, the city of Carthage is a little bit upset with me, but that's uh, its not the end of the world. They will be okay. Because um, they don't have a general anymore. Hmm. I, great lord. I feel like... Maybe, I don't know, maybe my faction leader died or something. I felt like I had a general there. Not 100% sure what happened on that front. Hmm. Yeah, we've definitely taken some hits on the generals' fronts recently. As you can see, we had, uh, yeah, the Salties, the Honest has died in battle. We got a few generals die in battle, so, um, but we should have, uh, more, uh, more coming. On the front over here in Spain, in Iberia, we did, uh, we did have a, um, uh, <clears throat> what's it called? Uh, preemptive strike on the Britons. Uh, knocked out one of their armies, and we need to basically clear out the peninsula and set up a defensive fortification on the north border. Uh, I do think they don't really want war with me, though. Um, and here in Tingi, uh, we are close to finishing off the, um, the Midians here, but they do have three generals left uh, in that settlement, so this force here is definitely not enough to take that settlement. That is why yeah, we're sending over some reinforcement cavalry. Drop them off. And yeah, we can uh, we can go ahead and put the settlement under siege, and we'll hold that under siege for a while. I'm no rush to, uh, no rush at all to go take it. Uh, Corduba is unhappy, um, so we should focus on, on building um, temples here. Uh, again, I, I just don't know what I was thinking. Why do I need, why do I need the farms and food production? It just seems so dumb. Um, no, we just want, let's just get the public order. Public order all the way. Um, it'll take, you know, it's a hit for the time being, but we will build that back up. Uh, there, this is the most significant Britain force, I think, in the region. Uh, we also have the settlement here that is guarded by just a family member and a small force. Um, we could go and hit that with our captain. Uh, I don't think our captain is strong enough, however, to fend off the other forces that are here in the region. Uh, so we might want to uh, sort of, I don't know, avoid and evade for the time being and wait for reinforcements. Um, although we are a bit trapped, um, so we might need to send those reinforcements sooner um, rather than later uh, to get to them. Uh, we also have this Britain army here. Um, why don't we... Yeah, maybe we could just go take that army out right now. Um, we have our 26-year-old, very, you know, formidable, I feel, you know, formidable general here. 
and we can give him let's just give him some reinforcements and go knock that army out and we'll do a nice early fight here even now fear works its magic into all right Await my orders. oh I just realized. I did not have- I noticed my game was a bit laggy, um, and I was a bit confused as to why, uh, and I just figured it out because my computer wasn't plugged in. Um, good thing it didn't run out of battery, it wouldn't be the first time I've ever done that, but, uh, yeah, that's kind of funny, it would, that would have been a bummer. But there we go, it's running smoother now. But not that, not like that, yeah, a little more spread out. Alright, let's get our units into a nice formation. I do have chariots, and I don't have a, you know, this is where archers would be really helpful against chariots, but I don't, I don't have, you know, a so solid archer's force. They are, and they are using this hill, these rocks here, in their defense, um, which is smart. And they got some slingers as well. Oh, I have slingers also. Did not realize that. Um, I, I don't want my cavalry going one-on-one -on -one with their... Uh, chariots, if possible. So why don't we bring our cavalry that direction, and we'll advance on their chariots with infantry, and hopefully our skirmishers and slingers um, will be able to do some good damage to their uh, to their chariots. That will be that will be the plan. Let's let everyone get into position here. position rather quickly. There we go. What is this unit that's moving forward? It's just a, a wood warrior's unit. What is their weapon? It's a swords unit. So maybe this unit can, uh... I feel like our cavalry would be able to take that unit out pretty quickly. And they are moving their chariots over towards the side with my cavalry. Why don't we... Let's go hit the wood warriors with my cavalry. Do this little trick to keep my general out of the front of the fray. They're a heavy sword infantry unit. Um, yeah, they routed right away. Sword infantry against you know cavalry. That should that's an easy win. Um, and then they they charge a slingers unit forward as well. I mean that's fine if you know I don't want to overextend my cavalry. Oh, uh, are these art? Oh, are these? Yeah, these are bow chariots. Okay, uh, something to keep in mind. So let's just let these slingers kill enough of those slingers to get them to rout, and then let's pull the cavalry back. Actually, if you could pull to this flank, that would be perfect. And slingers, let's bring you over here, please. And now we can get infantry. Let's continue the advance. We'll have everyone run. Yeah, cavalry, I want you on the flank without the chariots, basically, essentially. Oh, something did come back. The Slinger's unit did return. Alright, that's not the end of the world. Slingers. Peltus. Please fire at the general. Come on, get get some get some get some off. Come on. Ah, I didn't do it in time. So annoying. All right, these singers are back to uh, back to routing. These guys grouped up. Let's continue the advance, please. Whoa! Come on, there we go. Cavalry still stay out in the flank. Yeah, we're gonna just keep these moving forward. We need our skirmishers firing at the general, if possible. Alright, skirmishers are firing now. Not at the general, though. Too far away. It's okay, we'll just let them uh, take out this infantry here first. That's fine. 
Yeah, guard mode, please. I don't want you. Alright. Alright, there it looks like they're pulling out of the battlefield. Let's see if I can't catch any with my cavalry. I, cavalry was a bit far away. I forgot that they were able to retreat. Let's go, charge in. Let's get knock out as many of these guys as we can, please. Yeah, we'll get some kills here at the end, but, you know, unfortunately not too many. Yeah, they pulled out of that battle, but we had a nice little methodical advance on them. I mean, we got some, and we knocked out a good number here. You can see we, we did take out a, a fair amount of the of the routing, uh, routing units here. Yeah, killing them right at the line. Every every man counts. See, we got a nice nice chunk out there, but they get a couple units, a couple units fully retreated. That's fine. Um, is there anyone left? That should be victory, right? Yeah, there we go. All right, and we got a little bit of round shield cavalry experience as well. Okay, that's where they retreated to. That's fine. That's the direction I want to move. Um. The question is, this unit, this force here, Orders? might be strong enough to fight this force on its own. That's how we're going to play this. We're going we're to forget about the city for now. That force can just kind of do its thing. Um, this Orders. army, I don't want these guys coming back this direction. How far can they, yeah, we want them... Chase down. And we can reinforce this force here. Let's give them a couple more units from the city. And we can train up another cavalry unit there in the settlement itself. Um, we're going to do a little bit of. I don't really want to train troops here. Those, set those settlements have two small populations. Uh, we really need a militia barracks here in Corduba. Uh, Carthago Nova is training up infantry. That's good. Okay. So I think Iberia is probably fine for the time being. Tingi's under siege. Uh, yeah, we, we need to stop. We need this general back. Basically. Um, we need him back in the fray, Bomilcar. He's too good a general to not have, uh, and not have his troops, you know, up in the actual fights here. Carthaginian Watchtower. Rebels currently hold it. Forgot about that. Uh, here, I mean, a port would be nice and profitable, right? Yeah. Yeah, to a degree. Is it worth the money right now, though? I'm not 100% sure. Um, it's only 800. Yeah, that'll pay off itself in a few turns. We'll do that. Dapsis. No, let's just keep training up some more cav. Alright, that's pretty much all we can do financially this turn. Let's just make sure... Yeah, our armies are She's in ready. good position, and these settlements have pretty low garrison, that's fine. Rome is doing its thing. Okay. And how are we looking with agents? So, right, Spy and Tarantum. Great one. Hey, this guy... Ugh, it's gonna take so long to get him back anywhere useful. Honestly, maybe we just leave him here and we'll, we'll send a fleet to pick him up eventually. My eyes are right, Tingi spy. I serve you with, I serve you Siwa spy. I serve you spy there. Great one. Right, Diplomat that we trained up in Palma. Palma's building a ship, we will ferry him over next turn. That's perfect. Alright. See if the Julii send another army. I mean, no, they're still not. Julia are still uh, rather relaxed in that regard, um, which is good. Recruitment report. Yeah, lots of recruitment. We're going to be losing money here. Um, absolutely for a minute. Timidy grew. Nice Corduba. Still not happy. We'll do the next Temple of Bald next level up. End of turn report. Yeah. They don't like me. How are we looking here? Engage oh, the enemy. it said I could assault last time because the spy had the gates open. I didn't realize I could actually change, you know, during the course of siege. Um, but yeah, they're here in the uh, in the settlement. They can hold out for another five turns. 
And then, yeah, here's the main force of Britons. There's the army we took out last turn. I guess let's, yeah, we'll just continue on that army. Take it out. Um, yeah, just about, it's just about eliminating the armies at this point. Alright, um, I'm gonna assume... We'll see where they are. We'll see where they set up. They just set up straight across. Alright. Full army. Advance, please. And thank you. Yeah, we'll get them, uh... Get them up. This is just the remnants of the, uh, army from last time. Yeah, they still have those dang chariot archers, but the infantry are severely outmatched. And, uh, yeah, my guys are moving into position. We don't have a lot on the cavalry front, so we'll keep our cavalry together here. Nice big infantry line to uh, outmatch theirs. And you can, they can all run into position now. Skirmishers. And slingers on the right flank, please. Everybody in position. Skirmishers can be a bit closer to the line. Yeah, and their uh, their their archers are starting to open fire. That's fine. Let's uh, push up immediately. Cavalry, get up there. All right, here come their men, and uh, it should play out pretty similar to uh, to last episode. Let's just go, just go take out these archers. Yeah, these are not scythe. Oh, they are scythe chariots. So it's okay. General, sit back, please. But the rest of the cavalry, let's just chase them down. Alright, we're gonna have to, uh, yeah, we're gonna take these, this infantry out here. Yeah, surround them, there we go. Boom, they're done. Yeah, slingers, we're firing in on them as well. General, get out of there. Yeah, they're, uh, okay, there we go. We did trap them. Cavalry got to them. Nice. Alright. Good job, guys. Cavalry will do a little bit of mop-up work. Yeah, they got a little bit of units left here. There we go, they're routing immediately, and we'll continue. Let's just make sure this army does not come back to us. And we'll take out the rest of their warbands here. Come on, get them. There we go. And done. Alright, it's very straightforward. Alright, so that army was taken out, and, um, this army... Yeah, we'll move them. I just want to make sure that this, this guy doesn't, you know, the city's a little bit on the vulnerable side right now, you know? Um, so I just want to be a little bit careful with that. Tingy's still under siege, which is good. How you doing down here, Bomacar? Move out. Watch tower it. Build tower. Yeah. Um. That's that's probably that's that's probably I enough leave. for now. Move out. Out of move. Such a bummer that the roads don't build through this stretch. You know, this is just all wasteland, uh, basically, um, in this game. Obviously, not in real life. <laughs> and yeah, we'll get some uh, recruitment going still. Alright, this large army 
I think we should immediately strike back at uh, at Tarantum here. Hi, my lord. Disembark. And we actually could attack it. It's just woodwork, so I, I, you know, I, yeah, I think we could do it. Let's just immediately, immediately strike back here and assault. I want Tarantum back. I want this army done. I'm so mad at what happens here, and let's go. Alright, so we do have the gates open now. We could be a little strategic with it. First of all, we have our legitimate hoplites now. Our outstanding, very, very high-level sacred band infantry. Um, so this is, you know, not just the uh, Libyan spearmen. Um, but what I am thinking is maybe we use our infantry here to advance in one side, and we have our maybe weaker infantry. Weak infantry here supported with elephants, which these are the war elephants, right? Yeah, these elephants are archers. They are the war elephants. And... Yeah, we'll have a general on each flank. This general can have the weak... General with the weak cavalry. You, sir, can command the middle with the infantry and just be there for support. And then right side here, we can have the strong cavalry and my third general. Okay. We have first and foremost Astadi guarding that entrance. Let's move our let's use our elephants and their uh, ranged attack on them. We have our central center group here. That can move into position. Slowly but surely behind the phalanxes. Let's hear Hastati. Elephants have opened fire. Okay. And here we have our right, our other flank. Ah, perfect. Guarded by Velotes. Let's immediately charge in with our cavalry and knock out this gatehouse. Uh, one second. What is this? Oh, there's damaged walls over here from the last battle. And so they have men guarding it. Okay. Cavalry. Understood, I did not realize that. Yeah, so immediately, Velotes, we should be able to knock him out with our cav. So let's be strategic with this. There is some, uh, Samnite mercenaries entering into this area. Which are spear unit. Spear unit infantry. and therefore uh, good against the cavalry. Yeah, this seems actually rather stupid. Let's back back out. This, uh, the Sam Knights really came in with the... Uh, yeah, the Sam Knights really made a difference there. Let's pull everyone out of this fray. Velotes, that's an easy win, but when once the spear units uh, got involved, it just became a lot more difficult. Okay. This is our right flank. City's completely open here. They did they did back off. So why don't we move in with our men here? Slowly but surely, no rush. Yeah, most of the enemy units have abandoned the walls. You can see they're all, a lot of them are pulling back towards the city center, including the generals. Uh, there are still a couple vulnerable units over here. What do we have? We have a, a Stadi unit, and okay, that's their phalanx, their uh, mercenary phalanx. And why don't we... And we get this force into the city as well, as long as it's, uh, you know, as long as it's undefended here in the front, may as well. Yeah, so we are entering into the settlements. Most of their men have pulled back to city center. These, uh, Samnite mercenaries, you can see how many dead cavalry men there were. That was, uh, the Samnites really turned the tide there on that flank.
Alright, we'll speed up and let everyone enter in. Okay, I do see movement on this flank. Yes, okay. Let's speed this up. We have a phalanx unit that's moving in towards our elephants. Don't want to let that happen. So we're going to speed up the entrance of our cavalry here into the settlement. Uh, are they coming for us or are they going to the city center? They're going to the city center. Okay. And then we do have that one Hastati unit there. Okay, no, they turned. Alright, let's prepare for a defense. Alright, what did they charge forward with? Sam Knights? Infantry. 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 Alright, we have them in position. General. Why don't you pull back? And then the Libyan Spearmen can uh, can go behind. Sacred Band in position, please. Sacred Band in the Phalanx formation. Yep, they're going to charge right into the front of the Phalanx. That's fine with me. How are we looking over here? They're just sitting inside the gatehouse. Okay, that's fine. Sacred Band. Yeah, they're gonna they're gonna be able to hold this hold this pretty well. There we go. They broke immediately. Sacred Band advance. Their study will not uh, not be able to do anything against the uh, phalanxes. Immediate route. There we go. All right, sacred bands. You're going to be leading our front here. You know what? Libyan spearmen will actually lead it. I want to save my sacred band if I can. Libyan Spearmen, go and hit the Sam Knights, please. This force is annoying me. Let's go. Let's just charge it. Because I want this cavalry free. Libyan Spearmen can, uh... Continue just an aggressive push here against the infantry. With the hoplites at their back, as well as the general. Yeah, their infantry are putting up a nice defense, but we are slowly and steadily pushing them pushing them backwards. Infantry. I know this is kind of a sacrifice of this infantry, but I just want to knock that out. Come on, guys. You gotta win that fight. Libyan spearmen are, you know, they're taking casualties, but, you know, they're doing their job. Which is just wearing down the Roman uh, infantry. And then my cavalry only flank, again, I mean, there's not much they can do here. We can move them in. Alright, the phalanx is down to 29. And they routed. There we go. Go after the Stadi. How are we over here? Libyan Spearman, you're doing your thing still. Taking casualties, but pushing back the enemy. How about these men? They're funneling into the city. Still a spear unit here. Okay, no, 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 no. I don't want... Libyans, no, no, don't. I don't want you in the 
city center yet. I just wanted you to do some damage there to the uh, Astadi units and just, just wear down their infantry a bit. Alright, you guys charge in the city center. Alright, let's see if we can't knock out these Sam Knights, even though it's with the cab. Now that we're all in and we're not fighting them at the gatehouse. I'm thinking they will drop a lot quicker. Get a good surrounding action on them. Yep, they dropped really quick. And then a Hastati unit. That should be easy to take out. Yeah, get your spears down and just defend here for a time being. You, General. Come on. There we go. Alright, this cavalry over here on this flank is taking quite a hit. Should have given some infantry support. Alright, well, here we go. Everyone, let's get in here. There's their Roman general. Can we please break through on that flank? Thank you. Four bands go after their general. You guys get in on the general, please. Let's go. Not war bands, sorry. Sacred bands. March in on the generals, please. Spearmen. In on the generals. Alright, hoplites, hit the generals, please, from the flank. What is this over here? Astadi, get out of here. Alright, we are taking tons of casualties. As their generals just continue to uh, be extremely frustrating. Let's see if I can't get my cavalry out of there and just let my... Uh, Sacred Bands finish them off. They don't have many left. Sacred Bands have definitely done its job well. Yeah, the Sacred Band have done its job very well. Look how many. Yeah, we should... There we go. We should be able to finish them off. Jesus. Ooh, baby. Alright, I did lose one general. I think that's one of the captains. That's fine. It's not the end of the world. Boy, what a uh, what a tough, tough siege! But we did knock out. Look at this! Look at this in the middle. Oh, so, so many horses! Oh my god! All right. Whew. That was a slog and a half. But victory. We have conquered. Tarantum is ours. All right. We have the city back. We did lose a general in the process, but uh Milk Yatsen Corrales, I don't think was a legitimate member of our house. Fortunately. Well, yeah, wasn't he a captain? I don't know, I'd have to go back and look. It doesn't really matter, he was unmarried, it wasn't going to produce any offspring, it's fine. Um, that's not the end of the world. We had to, uh, we had to make that progress here. It was, that was heavily necessary. Okay. Severely, severely wounded. Um, army, though. So, first things first. Yeah. 
right, we're gonna... It's gonna take us a few turns to uh, fully retrain this force. That's okay. Um, you guys can move up to Tarantum. Mighty General. Orders. Mighty General. Yeah, these guys don't have any movement points left. Um, okay, Spy. Back up towards Capital, please. I do have a Spy. No, I don't have a Spy in Capital already. Alright, you can go into the city. Oof. And, uh, yeah. Man, was that a slog, huh? Alright, but we got Tarantum back. And, uh, now we need to, we need to go eliminate the Skippy Eyes so that we just have one Roman enemy left. Um... We do have a very nice army in Rome as well, so I'm not worried about the defense there uh, too much. Yeah, we gotta... We'll fix that up soon. Uh, Iberia, the movement's already done. Yeah, that was a long long turn, long battle. Um, but I think, you know, we got it done. And that's what matters. We got the victory. Okay. Next turn. Alright, Julia and I are back at Rome. Ooh. Britannia. Um, let's see if I can't win this one. The enemy are here. Await my All right, so I'm on the defensive. Units, oh, they got chariots. All right. Libyan spearmen, please Units, form a nice big line. Yeah, we got... Um, yeah, we got some... We got some cav, though. We're gonna have to use that to our advantage. Yeah, these chariots, uh, that's why I hate fighting the Britons. I think infantry-wise, I'm okay. I mean, this warband's not a very... Not a very good force, you know? What we are going to have to do, though, is we are going to have to flush out these uh, chariot archers. We can't leave them with such a huge range advantage on us. So if that means taking some cavalry losses to knock them out, well, that's ex okay. Actually, they melt pretty quickly to cavalry, these guys. That's good. Just knocked out the cav. Your general is fleeing from the enemy. You guys can all this all engage. Whoa, why did all my men route? What? Oh my god. Oh my god. No 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 no. What the heck? Get out of there. Get out of there. I'm telling you to get out of there. Get out of there! Oh my god, what the hell? I got like hundreds of cavalry routing. Jesus. My god, that's ridiculous. Alright, what the f whatever. First, first set of chariots melts like they're nothing. Second set of chariots, like, can't fight for, for, for anything. They can't fight whatsoever. This army's going down. Um, I'm starting to think maybe that second set of chariots was a general. The first set was just that terrible archer's unit. And that was the difference. But, I mean, all my cavalry just completely, completely broke. Alright. Infantry, let's go. This time we will be a little bit smarter, I guess, with our cav. How do they have a full unit back? I, I took that unit out last fight. And now it's a full unit again. Alright, whatever. Ridiculous.
This Iberia region, this entire game, has been nothing but one big pain in the ass. I mean, seriously, whether it's, you know, whether it's fighting Spain and now Britain, it's just been one, one just ridiculously annoying campaign after another. I just want to be done with it. I just want to take the region and never have to come back. Let's just solidify the north. Knock these guys out once and for all and just be done with this dang place. Slingers opening fire. Nice. There we go. Slingers. Took out one at least. Yeah, Slingers have them in range. That's good, Slingers. Slingers should keep uh, keep knocking at them. There you go, Slingers. Sure, sometimes Slingers are like my favorite unit. Units! Cavalry! Cavalry! Units! Charge! Yeah, we'll just go knock out the archers. Infantry. Alright, they charged in. All this infantry. Go help. Forgot to turn these guys off. That mode. General, get this way. There we go. Alright, they're fleeing. They're general. General's bodyguards fleeing. Alright, there we go. Alright, we got the warband, the mass route, and that should be that. Oh. getting so frustrated with this campaign in the last couple videos. Like, some of the things that have been happening are just so frustrating, so annoying. Nah, no one left in this fight is escaping this battlefield. No way. They almost did. Ah, wait, there's someone else. Who is that? I did not notice it. A unit routing out that direction. They were there far away. They might escape. Credit to them if they do. I think it's just, is it just one guy. Oh, he's... Ah, he made it. Oh, good for him. Congratulations. He barely made it in time. But made it nonetheless. Victory! Okay, faction destroyed. Dacia's done. Wow, okay. Uh, we actually made some money. Death stalks the land in the Libyum. Okay. New family member. Construction completes. Some recruitment. Traits increase. Superior commander. And retinue expands. Command when fighting against barbarians. Is that this guy? Yeah. What a nice name. Sakarbal. What a great name for a general. Alright. Looks like the only Spanish troops left. Oh, we already have a spy there. <laughs> Whoops. The only Spanish troops left in Spain are these units around the final settlement. And, I'm sorry, the only um, Britain troops left are those units around the settlements. Um, we do have a f another full stack. Jesus. Another entire full stack coming into the city. Because, of course, we do. And we can, uh, yeah, I guess we can prepare for that. Uh, sire, you guys, move, move back out. this direction. No more move, sire. Yeah, Cordoba is just perpetually, perpetually upset. Uh, I mean, ugh. Come on now. Alright, how about over here? Attack! I guess we can finally assault this city, right? Tingi. Army strength ratio is 1 to 1. Let's see how we can do this. Let's see if we can do this. Alright. 
All right, let's go ram. What do we have here? We got some Eastern Infantry. Yeah, some Cav. Namidian Missile Cavalry. And their General's Bodyguard. Desert Infantry. That's in the city center. Archers. Okay. Well, let's go use this ram to get the gate down. That's, uh, that's priority number one. Yeah, they got this missile cavalry. He's probably gonna throw some spears at me as I do that. Your soldiers have brought the ram to the gates. Right, let's get you guys up to the front. And the general and his cavalry just slowly making their way forward. All right, any second now. Gate should open. Look at that timing. Troops arrive, and boom, gates the are open. Soldiers have broken through the gate. Now order them on and hound the enemy. And we will immediately push in with our spearmen. Let's just break. Let's just. We just got to break in here. Get a foothold. Yeah, those guys. I was to say they should run. Come on, this is a desert infantry unit. Let's take him out. Uh, this is what I was afraid of. They're gonna just push right in at the gatehouse. And just hold me at the gatehouse. They pushed him with their general's bodyguard. Right off the bat. Oh my god. Yeah, their goal, they're just holding at the gatehouse. That's their goal all the way. They're just, they're just literally throwing their entire force at the gatehouse. get them to potentially pursue outside the gates. Get more in an open field. It does not appear so. But they fell back. So we can actually push in a little bit better with our cavalry here. Oh my god, I mean, I, yeah, there's... Okay, there's just, there's no way. There's no way. Just get out of here. Everyone get out of there. My god. Come on! How will your soldiers greet this news? Come on! God, I told you to retreat! Re Frickin' retreat! Defeat is a in the army. All right, another general dead. Just gonna add us this time. We are uh, we are losing generals left and right. Um, Libyum has the plague. Your humble servant. My God. Set sail, moving ashore. All right, you can go in the Aye, port. I eh, go in the port Out here, I guess. Move, sire, yes, mighty lord. Yes, mighty lord. Oh, I cannot do that, geez. sire. My liege, move out! Alright, we're gonna pick up some guys in Dimity and get back up there. Orders, orders, orders. Sire, march! No more moves, All right. sire.
Garth, I mean, just keep training. Keep training. Keep training. It's retraining. Repair the wall. Orders? Might Send all these them. guys to Proton. Retrain them. All right. Got a Julii fleet with an army on it. Let's see if I can't. Ready. Yes, mighty lord. Can't sell there, oh my god, lord. just hit, hit that. There we go. We are supreme. Let's see if we can't. Is that them? Yeah, that's them. I Let's keep chasing them down. Prepare to engage. We are supreme. Yes, couldn't, my uh, lord. I, my lord. couldn't sink the force. Not really sure exactly where they went, but they're somewhere. Ready to sail. Prepare to engage. Victory. I, my lord. Out of moves, sire. Somewhere up there. Um, they're laying siege to Rome again. Um, it's fine. Again, I'd prefer to fight this defensively, but we will see how it happens. And then I would like to, if we can, get aggressive and go take out Capital. Again, I have three more generals here. Oh, oh god. Like, take out all that cavalry. Jeez. Right, we're going to wait another turn, though, obviously, until everybody is retrained. And, uh... Yeah, let's turn. Cordoba's now riding. Lovely. Alright, Death Stalks the land. It's in Cordoba now, too? I mean, come on. Earthquake. Whoa, look at that animation. Ha! Huh. I don't think I've ever seen that before. I didn't even realize it does this animation for an earthquake. Look at that. Wow. Um. Mighty General. Not sure why. Where is Sakar? Where is he? Did it kill him? Did I just lose more generals? Did, did that really just kill them? Oh my god. Earthquake just killed them. Alright, well, when it rains it pours, huh? Just completely knocked out my general. Who is in this army? He's just, he's just gone. He's just, nope, you don't have him anymore, but their general. Their general lives. They're one that's standing in the exact same province, actually closer to where the earthquake was. He lives. My general dies. Of course. Two guys died. A spy and my general. And they got a whole nother huge annoying ass chariot force. Your obedient servant. I cannot do that, sire. Uh, I speak with them so, at once. So damn long. Depleted, sir. Sire. Forward. All right. Orders. Well. Sire. Mighty general. Orders. Do we do best. Mighty general. Orders. My liege. Mighty war. general. March. I don't care if you dislike me, Oscar. F off. Orders. Prepare for battle. Wow. All right, see how this goes. Today is a good. Await my orders. Oh my Good God. troops have arrived on the battlefield. Send them to the point of crisis. Move at the double. Shield cavalry.
forgot how that works in this game. I can't even use them until my units, like, die, essentially. Shield cavalry. Shield cavalry. Cavalry. Shield cavalry. Let's see if we can't go pick off any of their guys. Some cav. Some over here. Barbarian Warlord? No, we're not going to charge that. These guys over here, though, we're going to try to be annoying with them. A little unit of 72 warbands. Let's see if we can't take you out. What is this? Barbarian Peasants? Okay. Alright, we got them. These guys just decided they don't want to join the fight, huh? Alright, let's go after the light chariots, the missile cav. Or missile chariots, whatever they are, they're missile cavalry unit type, right? These guys routing? They're shaking, we can... Oh, I, I confused the flags. Uh, good job, cav, you did some damage. guys moving back here. Is that their warlord? That's their warlord up there. Let's go after those light chariots, missile chariots. Go take them out. Yep, there they go. Alright, now you can go rejoin the rest of the force again. Way to go. Way to take out their, uh, their missile chariots. Good job, guys. And these guys don't have missiles, right? No, they just have swords on them. Units. 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 All right. Good job. Took out a few of their units. I thought I was going to be fighting this fight with all this additional infantry. But nope. Nope, gotta fight it with these seven. These seven injured infantry units. I would never have done this fight if I knew I didn't have all those reinforcements. I guess I could retreat. That's not really fun, is it? Hey, why aren't you guys moving? Get all these guys up here in position. Oof. Yeah, my line is weak. Look at all those men standing right there. Let's charge their swordsmen. Infantry. Attack quickly. We're gonna take the fight to them. Skirmishers need to run up to there. Get a big charge in on the swordsman unit. Let's see if we can't break them right away. There we go. Cavalry loop around the back, please. That whole that whole side of the line completely collapsed. This whole side of the line is fighting. We're just gonna keep trying to sweep down here and get a uh, get a chain of routing going as the rest of my line completely disintegrates. 
Good thing my cavalry is doing well. It's funny, their whole, their whole left, their whole right flank collapsed, and my whole right flank collapsed. All right, we gotta take out their barbarian warlord now. It's our only chance. So let's just try. <laughs> Get him. Actually, some of our reinforcements came in there. Their, re their general ran. All right, we actually have, we actually have this. We have this in the end. Who would have thought? Right. General, hit the warbands there. Hit them. Hit them. Hit them. You guys. Hit them. There we go. Good stuff. Um, what the heck is going on over here? Their guys are just chasing down my my routers, huh? open slot. Anyone want to come in? No one? Alright. Nope. 39 cav routing. That's fine. That makes sense. We got space. Reinforcements. Hello. You guys want to come or not? You're right there. I guess not. Alright, we'll just round out the rest of these guys. Yeah, it shouldn't take too long. They'll just melt. Alright, everyone get in the position. We got, what, two units left here? Oh, now you guys, and now they want to come back in. Now that it's now that it's a winning fight. Now that we're going to win this one, now you guys want to come and help out. I see. So nice of you to join. Dang losers. Very simply. Let's just go attack him. With the cavalry and just end this thing. Oh my god. What a slog. Alright. Warband, they were at it immediately. Alright, we'll take them out. What do we have left here? Uh, head hurlers. Oh, those guys are fun. Alright, let's go get them. And they're not routing. Oh, there they go. Alright, yep, none of them are making off the field alive. And done. Alright. Cut a lot of guys, took a lot of damage. 
Trait increase, Superior Commander. Great, hopefully you don't die from a random Fire! earthquake. Mighty General. Um... I'm gonna send an army now to finish this. This unit can go back. The Eerie Wars will have two guys left. Um, all this cavalry is fine. Do some, do some combos here. You guys can go back. What do we have space for? Five more men? Let's do the ranged units. The other cavalry. And a full unit of infantry. You guys are going to go attack the city, you guys are going to go back to Oska. And, honestly guys, that's where I'm going to end the video, so, thanks everyone for watching, um, pain, a real pain of an episode, not going to lie, but, uh, but we're turning it around, um, we almost, almost have Iberia secured, and then we can just guard the northern border, and, and that would make it a heck of a lot easier, um, Italy is, is, you know, recovering, we're getting it back, um, we just, again, we just need to go one city at a time, right? Make our way up the peninsula. So, thanks everyone for watching. If you enjoyed and you make it all the way through, you know, like and subscribe to my channel. I uh, really appreciate that. And as always, I look forward to seeing everybody in the next episode. Have a good one.